Welcome into the Recap Rush Hour for Wednesday, June 7th. I'm David Kaplan. It's brought to you by Chevy Drive Chicago.com, your Chicagoland Chevy dealers. Folks, we got a lot to get to, so let's get going. Preseason schedule in the NFL was released by the league this afternoon. Here is the Bears three game slate. Tennessee at Chicago on August 12th. That's a noon kick at Soldier Field. On the 19th, that's a 6 p.m. kick, Bears at Indianapolis Colts. And on the 26th, Buffalo at Chicago. That is a noon kick that closes out the pregame slate. Rockford, you heard me right, Rockford, don't laugh, is pitching itself as a potential new home for the new Bears stadium. I love the aggressiveness, Rockford. You got absolutely no shot. Rockford? That's hilarious. Not going to happen. Bears president Kevin Warren today met with New Chicago Mayor Brandon Johnson. They issued a joint statement. They'll continue their dialogue. Sources have confirmed to me there is zero chance the Bears will re-sign at Soldier Field. A new stadium? That was what they discussed today. It's still very unlikely, and Arlington Heights is a prohibitive favorite, but at least the two sides are talking. Jalen Johnson spoke to the media after today's practice and said his daughter was his focus off this offseason and that his coaches knew that and he hoped they understood and that his focus is also not on a contract extension. He said, I don't even have an agent, but he will be signing with one soon. Offensive guard Nate Davis made his first appearance at OTAs. He was there today. He signed from the Titans as a free agent to start on the O-line for the Bears this past offseason. White Sox at Yankees postponed tonight. Straight doubleheader weather permitting tomorrow. It's all related to the wildfires in Canada. The National Weather Service air quality rating deemed hazardous. Six out of six on the six-point hazardous air quality scale. Go online, Google, or Twitter search a picture of what's going on in New York right now. It's eerie. It's like a movie. Cubs at Angels, game two of their three-game series. Tyone versus Berea. Cubs lost last night 7-4. I'll have a recap after that game goes final tonight. Breaking NBA news. Chris Paul has been told he will be waived by the Phoenix Suns. Hey, Bulls, you're going to run all these veterans back? There's your veteran point guard that you desperately need with Lonzo Ball out. Go get him. Chris Paul, future Hall of Famer. Hell of a player. And the Nuggets, a three-and-a-half-point favorite at Miami tonight in game three of the NBA Finals and our Four Seasons Heating, Air Conditioning, Plumbing, and Electric quote of the day. Brandon Johnson said to Kevin Warren today, I grew up a Bears fan. I love the 85 Bears. Let's find a way to keep them shuffling, Super Bowl shuffle, in Chicago. Love it. Keep the dialogue going. Have a great rest of your day. See you after the Cubs game. Take that.